There's no denying that the relationship between Brendan Gallagher and Montreal Canadiens head coach Martin St. Louis has deteriorated. Gallagher, once a heart and soul player for the Canadiens, now finds himself in a precarious position within the team. At 32, his body has endured countless injuries, and the once dynamic winger now struggles to keep up with the pace of the NHL. The tension between Gallagher and St. Louis, which has reportedly been growing, is palpable. It's becoming clear that Gallagher is no longer a part of the team's future plans, and the cracks in their relationship are becoming impossible to ignore. Gallagher's $6.5 million per season contract, which runs until 2027, adds another layer of complexity. It's a deal that now feels burdensome, especially for a player relegated to the fourth line, in a position that doesn't suit his strengths. What's worse? Gallagher hasn't even had a shot at earning a place in the top nine, a role he used to excel in. Meanwhile, other players, even those with less experience or talent, have had their opportunities. St. Louis' apparent decision to sideline Gallagher, not just on the ice, but even in public mentions, is glaring. The veteran forward has been ignored during press briefings, and any reference to a more prominent role has been conspicuously absent. What's undeniable is that the Canadians are in a phase of transition, prioritizing younger players over worn-out veterans like Gallagher. This has turned Gallagher into an uncomfortable presence in the locker room, a constant reminder of past glories that have now faded. His demeanor, marked by frustration and what seems like quiet resentment, adds to the unease. Despite his years of service and leadership, Gallagher appears to be clinging to a role that no longer exists for him, while everyone else moves on. Behind the scenes, it's becoming clear that the Canadians' management, including Kent Hughes, may be preparing for a contract buyout as early as 2025. This could be the beginning of the end for Gallagher in Montreal. It's an unfortunate situation for a player who gave everything for the team, but it's the harsh reality of professional sports, where aging veterans often face tough endings. For now, Gallagher remains part of the Canadiens' roster, but his diminishing impact on the ice, coupled with his hefty contract, suggests that his time in Montreal is rapidly coming to an end. It's a sad chapter for both Gallagher and the Canadians, but it's a necessary move if the team is to fully embrace its rebuilding phase. At this point, the writing is on the wall, and the only question remaining is when the inevitable will happen. Stay subscribed for more videos.